Here's a headline from the Daily Mail. Influencer makes history as Playboy's first ever, first ever gay male cover star posing in a version of iconic bunny costume, but Twitter is baffled by guy-focused magazine nonsense choice to feature a man on its front. A Filipino influencer. Oh, is there anything worse than influencers? Filipino influencer Bretman Rock, 23 years old, who lives in Hawaii, covers a digital issue dressed in a sexy Playboy bunny costume. Many people are, uh, are confused. Some people on Twitter complain, saying this is how you kill a brand in nine seconds. There he is. How brave. Hey, hey, uh, this is exactly, ladies and gentlemen, what we all wanted to get our hands on uh, when we were young. You know, Playboy Magazine is exactly why we want to get our hands on Playboy Magazine when we were young boys. Because most young boys want to spend some quality time ogling a confused man dressed like ladies. A confused man dressed like a, a, a bunny in, in lingerie. That's exactly what we were all trying to go for. Now listen, I know Hugh Hefner ran one of the most prolific honey trap operations before there was a Jeffrey Epstein. So I guess it's only right that Playboy would continue its role in the psychological subversion of a nation and its boys. But, um, man, oh, man, this is what it looks like when there's no more history left to be made. When you have to become the first gay Filipino to appear on the cover of a porno mag for straight men seeking naked women. That's fucking pathetic. But it belongs in clown world. It certainly does. So, I mean, um, whatever. How pathetic. I feel bad for the, uh, feel bad for the guy, too, even though he doesn't, um, he probably doesn't feel bad for himself. He probably thinks he's a superhero, he <laughs> which he's just not.